to locate applications for payment, first navigate to Budget and Cost Management and down to Applications for Payment. You can see all pay apps listed out here. Help organize by using the grouping and sorting options along the top and our filtering options on the right hand side. To create a new pay app, select Create New, select the cost period, and the contract. Let's take a look at a pay app already underway. Off to the right, you can select the status. Choose to lock these amounts. Select the application date, cost period, approved on date, category, the date that this app was paid, and the reference. You can also make any assignees here. Under the Application for Payment tab, we first have a general financial summary here, general notes, and our detailed items. For each item, you can enter the work this invoice value, which includes material install and stored material, or you can enter those numbers separately. There's also the percent complete and the retainage percentage and amounts. All SOV items associated with this contract are automatically added to this application for payment. Contract invoices and general invoices are only added if marked for inclusion. You can also add more items here if not broken out in the original contract. Select the Add CO to add PCCO items. Other tabs include a comments area for general communication, financial summary for a more detailed financial information, and contact information that details the to company and from company.